The prehistoric world was home to many huge versions of today's animals, like the dragonfly the size of your arm, or the shark the size of a whale. In today's video, we'll be taking a look at the sea turtle the size of a car. Meet Archelon. The name means ruling turtle, and rightfully so. This gigantic reptile grew up to 15 feet long and weighed 2 tons. That's about the same size as a Volkswagen Beetle. Named in 1895 by paleontologist George Reber, the Archelon genus only contains one species, Archelon Eschyros. While it looked very similar to the leatherback sea turtle, Archelon actually has been sorted into the family Prostegidae, the members of which are all extinct today, while the leatherback has been sorted into the separate family of turtles, Dermaclidae. The huge animal lived in the shallow North American inland sea, an ocean sitting right smack dab in the middle of North America, where the bottom of the ocean was almost never more than 600 feet down. The Archelon's turtle shell wasn't actually a shell, per se, like that of other turtles, but more like a leathery carapace spread across a complex skeletal structure made up of the turtle's rib bones, and strengthened by bone-like plates called neuralia and pleuralia. The skin, while lightweight, was probably thick, flexible, and strong, and still adept at protecting the animal, helping it to swim better than if it had one big, hard shell and the shell was most likely the exact weight it needed to be in order to achieve something called neutral buoyancy. That is, it allowed Archelon to use as little energy as possible, being too heavy to float to the surface, but just buoyant enough to keep it from sinking to the sea floor. The reptile could alter the amount of air in its lungs, making its body heavier or lighter, depending on if it wanted to go up or down in the water. Archelon probably fed on squid and jellyfish, much like modern sea turtles, but the strength of its jaw and sharpness of its beak may also suggest that it also ate animals with hard shells, such as mollusks and crustaceans. The beak may also have been used to shear the flesh off of fish or other smaller aquatic reptiles. Archelon possessed massive front flippers and short, compact arm bones that suggest they were very powerful, making the turtle a strong swimmer. And it had to be. Archelon shared its shallow ocean home with huge prehistoric sea monsters, such as the Tylosaurus or the giant shark Crotoxyrhina, who would think of Archelon as a tasty snack, and the soft shell, while still tough and leathery, was no match for a predator's teeth. The four large, star-shaped bones on the bottom of the turtle's stomach, however, may have been strong enough to help deter such attacks, or at least provide some defense. Archelon, like modern sea turtles, would have come up onto the shore to nest and lay their eggs, and then abandoned the young to venture out into the vast ocean and grow up on their own. The young turtles could have been easy prey for birds, pterosaurs, and small dinosaurs. This awesome animal was the biggest documented turtle ever discovered, and it's an example of how big and crazy animals used to get. Well, that's it for this video. If you liked it, please consider giving this video a thumbs up, and be sure to check out my channel for more videos featuring dinosaurs and other prehistoric animals. As for now, Paleoluke out.